Hello, Ben. Well, it's certainly feeling chilly out there today and it's going to get even colder as we go through the next few days. But hopefully we'll get to see much more in the way of sunshine. A bit like today, you can see in the satellite and radar from earlier, had some gorgeous winter sunshine across some parts of the UK, but still a few showers at times across some eastern parts. Now, those showers mainly falling as rain across much of England and Wales if you do happen to catch a shower. But for Scotland here, we could be seeing some sleet and snow and with the breeze, blizzard-like conditions here. But elsewhere, fine and dry today, but feeling cold. Highs there, 8 degrees, but of course it will be feeling much colder, especially in that wind. Now, as we go through this evening and tonight, further showers continue across the east. And again, we could be seeing some more accumulations of snow across northern parts of Scotland. Elsewhere, it's dry, lengthy, clear skies. We're going to see a severe frost across western parts, and there may be some icy stretches where we do see those showers. Take care. Bye-bye. Hello again. Well, I hope despite the chilly temperatures, you've still managed to have a lovely day so far. It's going to be feeling even colder as we go through the rest of the week. And there is the chance of some sleet and snow showers in places, although they will be hit and miss for most of us. Still a good deal of dry weather in the forecast, but there will be some widespread frost around. And also where we do see any showers, the risk of some ice too. So let's take a look at the bigger picture where you can see we're drawing in our airflow from the Arctic. It's cold, northerly winds spilling right across the UK and our daytime temperatures really struggling by day barely climbing above freezing. And for some areas, by the time we get to the weekend, it could be as cold as minus 10 overnight. Now for the rest of this evening and tonight, we've still got a few more of those showers feeding into eastern parts. And again, could be some sleet and snow across northern parts of Scotland for so the risk of some icy stretches here. Elsewhere, where we have the clear skies tonight, there will be a widespread frost and it's going to be feeling bitterly cold for us all tomorrow morning. So here's how things look on Wednesday morning. Again, we're going to see more of these showers streaming into some coastal parts. Could be a little bit wintry in places, but most of these tending to fall as rain, especially during daylight hours. But for northern Scotland, again, some sleet and snow showers here. And we've got that cold and northerly wind too blowing down the east coast. We're really taking the edge off those temperatures. Highs of 7 degrees, but you get caught in that wind. It's certainly going to be feeling much colder. And then for the rest of the week, feeling even colder across the UK. Temperatures barely above freezing and it will be frosty and icy at times. Bye bye. Hello and a very good evening to you. Hope you're all keeping toasty and warm. It's certainly going to be turning even colder as we go through the next few days. There is the risk of some sleet and snow showers in places, but these will be hit and miss. For most of us, actually, a good deal of dry weather in the forecast, but most of us will be seeing a widespread frost. And if we do see any showers, there is the risk of some icy stretches too. Now, for the rest of tonight, still a few showers around at times, especially across more eastern parts. And again, some of these showers can be turned to sleet and snow across parts of Scotland. So here, of course, there is the risk of some ice. But elsewhere, where we have the clear skies tonight, very cold and frosty. And that's going to take us into a bitterly cold start to the day on Wednesday morning. So again, more showers at times along some coastal parts. Could be a little bit wintry in places, but for most of us, these tending to fall as rain. It's Scotland once again, seeing some snow in places, but for most a good deal of sunshine on Wednesday, but feeling even colder. Bye-bye.